Hello, in this video I'm going to show you how we can record data from questions like this. This question was in my last video, how long does it take you to travel to school? 0 to 20 minutes, 21 to 40 minutes, 41 to 60 minutes and 60 plus minutes. So imagine you were on the street asking this, que this question to hundreds of people in a day and you've ended up with a hundred questions like this all answered with tick boxes in different ticks in different boxes. I don't want to have to go through and try and remember how many people took 0 to 20 minutes, how many people took 21 to 40 minutes, etc. It'd just be too confusing and it would take too long. So the best way to put this data into a table is to use a tally chart. I've got one drawn already just here. So I've got the time it takes people to walk to school, the same boundaries that are in the questions, a tally, which is something I'll explain in a second, and then I'm going to have the total amount of people. So say the first questionnaire I pick up has a tick in 0 to 20. I'm going to put a tally, so just a vertical line, in there. Say the next person had 21 to 40. I'll put one in there. The next person has 0 to 20, and so on. I'll just put a few in random places. Okay, with this one here, 21 to 40, I've now got four vertical lines. If I just carried on with lots of lines, when it gets to the end to count up the total, I could be counting lots of little square, lots of little lines all the way along, and it would take me longer. So we just put, when we want to put the fifth one, I'll draw a line straight across there, so that denotes five. So I carry on, some more. And then 0 to 20, if I want to put 5 again, I stroke through like that. And I've reached 10 here, another multiple of 5, so I can put a line straight through there. And another 5 there. And then I think we'll stop there. So now I need to count up my totals and put these in the total column. So here, each one of these means 5, so I've got 5, 6, 7, 8. For 21 to 40 minutes, I've got 5, 10, 11, 12. For 41 to 60 minutes, I've got 5, 6. And then for 60 plus minutes, I have 1, 2. So we could total these up to find out how many questionnaires um, were actually answered. So I've got 10, 16, 18, carry the 1, 1, 28 people were asked. My next videos are going to show you how we can represent these data in data like this in pictures or bar charts. Thank you.